Let's take a look at whether HI, that's hydrogen iodide, is polar or nonpolar. So we start with the Lewis structure here, and you can see that a pair of electrons is shared between the hydrogen and the iodine atom. So that's our chemical bond there, our covalent bond. When we look at polarity, we want to look at the difference in electronegativity between the elements. So iodine, if we look it up on the periodic table, 2.66 is its electronegativity value, where hydrogen is 2.20. So the difference here is 0.46, and often that's considered to be a polar bond when we have that difference. What that means is that the electrons here, these electrons in the bond between the hydrogen and the iodine atom, they're going to spend a little more time with the iodine. Because electrons are negative, that becomes a little more negative, and we have a little more positive for the hydrogen. So that's why we have a polar molecule. We have a positive and a negative pole. Let's take a look at this in three dimensions. So the white's the hydrogen, and the purple is the iodine. If we look at the surface of the molecule, the blue, that's going to be more positive, and the red is more negative. So you can see that the red, that's around the iodine atom, and then the blue, that's around the hydrogen. So we have more negative around the iodine, more positive around the hydrogen. It's a polar molecule. So in answer to our question, HI, hydrogen iodide, that is a polar molecule. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.